An update tonight from the Kent County prosecutor on the investigation into the shooting death of Patrick Leoya by a Grand Rapids police officer. Chris Becker released a statement this afternoon saying the investigation is still ongoing. 13 on your sides, Nate Belt joins us now with reaction from one of the family's attorneys. Yeah, Juliet, it's been 44 days since Patrick Leoya was shot and killed by GRPD officer Christopher Shore. Well, Becker says he still needs more time. Leoya's attorney, Van Johnson, says he's had plenty. In Chris Becker's release, he says in part, because of the extraordinary interest in this case, I felt it was important to inform the public that it will take additional time for a final decision. How does Leoya family attorney Ven Johnson take that statement? He'll do what he wants to do when he's good and ready to do it. Becker says the Michigan State Police report he received is incomplete and that he has been in regular contact with their investigators asking follow-up questions. He's going to say it's incomplete when it's really not incomplete. Becker goes on to say he determined that additional expert guidance beyond the scope of the MSP is needed to make a final decision. What experts? Who? Where are they from? 13 on your side looked at 10 previous officer involved shootings investigated by Becker and found a final decision took an average of nearly 45 days to be made. Becker's statement comes 44 days after Leoya was shot. You don't need 44 days in most cases when you have this video. Johnson says each day that passes grows harder for the Leoya family. This is re-victimizing the victims. They feel this is an open wound. Charges should have been brought a long time ago. Becker's statement did not provide a timeline of when the investigation may be completed. It does, however, say, well, he may get a complete MSP report soon. That doesn't necessarily mean a decision on charges is imminent. Juliet. Nate, thank you.